Hey. Had some terrific groomers this morning. It didn't feel like taping any. It was just kind of working on some new buttering combos. Um, but yeah, kind of a pow day up top of the mountain. And tips for this. Things like horseshoe proper right down the middle gets tracked out quick. So if you want to get any freshies, you often just got to traverse. Traversing is kind of uh, boring to tape, so I didn't really tape any of that. But uh, at least you can make it a way where it's hard to get to and then get some fresher turns and not be crossing as many paths um, but yeah it's a leg burner traversing across like that so that's why I recommend side slipping every single day you're on the mountain do it a little bit every day build up these quads so we can traverse traverse to first and get to some sweet spots wind blow that hurts bar tips all you do is approach it and stand there put it right behind you and let it pull you no trying to sit on it um, I, I rode up with a girl earlier when it was busy here and she tried to sit on it she had never made the t-bar apparently but she tried to sit on it instantly and then accidentally punched me in my face I'm like oh man in my head brand new goggles they're gonna be scratched first day well luckily there was just smudge marks from her gloves that I saw on them they're not actually scratched up but yep, 20% code in the description if you like these goggles. As I said before, I'm going to make a really good switch dance to riding tutorial. And uh, But long before learning how to switch dance carve, we just got to be able to ride our board's edge. We won't be carving or anything, it'll just be traversing the run. So uh, if you're struggling with your switch at all, this is what I want you to try. Find a wide open run. And instead of doing this, okay, switch dance toe side sliding down uh, sliding straight down pick a tree on the opposite side of the run and just try to glide there as fast as you can if you get going too fast try to cut your make your momentum cut up the hill a little bit but you just really need this balancing on your single edge at this point don't be playing around with pressurizing your board like adding extra pressure or decreasing or adding tilt or decreasing just find a thing on the other side of the run and try to get there fast gliding with our board's edge and main tip that I've seen people do wrong when I've tried to teach people this is where their shoulders and hips are so if we're used to riding regular often our hips are kind of angled forward a little bit towards where we're going maybe our shoulders too if we're getting aggressive with carving but for this I've seen people basically standing backwards and that's just not a good technique for this. Look at where you're going. Come to the edge of the run and stop. And the switch heel side one, it's 
the it's a uh, way harder but uh you need to be able to look over your shoulder and make sure no one's coming down to hit you because we are hardly moving so i have a big wide opening here now basically tra just traversing on these edges because that is such a different feeling then and will help for getting carving than doing this. So give that a try if you're working on your switch because when I make a good switch tutorial for it, then you'll already have some fundamentals down. So thank you all for watching. Happy shredding. Work on your switch riding. Extra fly.